The uh, match got off to a slow start, you know, I was feeling him out a little bit. Uh, you know, I was kind of waiting to see how he reacted, and he was a bigger guy, so I figured I'd wait to the end of the match to tire him out a little bit, so I kind of wore him out, pulled on his head, and then started working the tilts towards the end. Racked up the major decision to secure the uh, victory. All right, Newman. Numinitis, am I saying it right? Numinitis. Numinitis. Jim Numinitis. Uh, first off, that guy was pretty stacked up. How strong did he feel the first two periods? He was pretty strong. I mean, a after the first period, he he was really just dying out on me, and that's when I was able to, you know, actually start working a little better. In the beginning, I was just trying to hold on as much grip as I could just to tire him out and then work my way into it. All right. What are the goals this year? Jim, for you and for the Blue Streaks here of John Carroll? Uh, my goal so far is to uh, be an All-American. Uh, last year I had a rough year, you know, I wasn't wrestling well, and I'm coming back this year doing better, working harder. And uh, as far as the team, uh, we, we lost a lot of guys this year, but we're hoping to you know, make do with what we've got and do even better in the group. All right, Jim, you got anything else? Any shout-outs for people back in Broadview Heights or anything? Uh, I give a shout-out to Haverdell, T-Bone. Haverdell? Who's that? Coach Haverdell, Brexel, <laughs> Brexel coach. Uh, and then uh, Coach Frito, I'm no longer coaching at Brexel, but good guy. And Steve Mladenovic. Mladenovic? Yeah. Scuba Steve? Scuba Steve. All right, hey, Jim, thanks for the time and good luck, man. All right, thanks, man.